Ladies and gentlemen, this is Myomar Jalal and welcome to another exciting tutorial of Animotion Pro for Unreal Engine 5. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can float a boat in Unreal Engine 5. So stay tuned with me. I'm going to make this tutorial as simple as possible and as exciting as possible for you. So here we are in the ocean scene and we are going to see how to float the boat in Unreal Engine 5. You can download any boat model from Sketchfab. There are so many free boat assets on Sketchfab. We have already downloaded the boat model. To float the boat we are going to make a blueprint and then click on actor and name it wooden boat. Then double click to open blueprint. Now click on the add and then click on the static mesh and drag it out to default screen root. Now we are going to add some weight to the boat, enable the mass kg. Now click on the static mesh and search for boat and click on boat. So here is your boat and now click on simulate physics. Now we are going to add buoyancy and then click on wooden boat and click on add and search for arrow and now adjust its position. Now duplicate the arrow by pressing ctrl D and adjust its position. Duplicate once more and adjust its position and duplicate once more and adjust this position now compile it here we are going to add blueprint we just created and scale it down to 0 0.03 now click on play button and here you can see how it goes down and didn't float so let's fix it so first thing we are going to do we are going to copy the location of arrows and paste it in BOINC. Adjust the position of arrows carefully. Right click on location and copy the location. Now go to BOINC and click 4 times. And paste the first location and the first and then second location and third and fourth. Now compile it. Now click on play button, here you can see the board is floating. Thank you so much guys for watching this video till the end and I will try my best to come up with a very short tutorials easy to understand and easy to follow in the future. Thank you again for watching.